I'm going to show you how to update your DS808 tonight because I noticed earlier today when I was out working we've got 12 updates so you just turn the unit on and it'll tell you in the update that you've got a pile of updates so we click on updates and it's telling me I've got a load so I'll take that one and let it run I'm going to do this in real time so it should do this update quite quickly and then it allow me to do the rest well, it's completed the download so now it'll go and do the install on that particular program. What else have we got whilst we're in there? Alpha, Dodge, GM, Maserati, Mini BMW, Mercedes, Kia, Lexus, Toyota. Suzuki, Skoda, also Volkswagen Group again. So we got any big ones in there? Ah, they're all little ones tonight. So they won't actually take very long to um, download and install on the unit. This is the biggest one, this is a 72 meg system program update. And what it says there is opt optimizes the Portuguese interface display, optimizes the upgrade mechanism, optimizes the search function and fixes an error that shows on the data login. It's just going through a few updates in that now. It's done four of five of them. I'll reopen Maxides. Go back to update. So it looks like it's done the first update. So it's done the first one. Now let's do that little one. It's done the second one. It has to keep rebooting between updates. Well, we've been going over five minutes now and we've done two updates. And I'm going to go update all.
and it's got 10 updates left to do now it's that easy to update the um, DS808 it's such an easy unit to update So it's just done Fiat and Alfa Romeo, let's finish that one. And it's downloading Volkswagen and Skoda now and Seat. Oh that is a big file. That's 727 megs. And the Mercedes Sprinter one is 994. Rolls Royce and BMW and Mini is 401 meg. Some of these are big files. So I'll bring you back once it's finished updating. And I'll show you everything is then up to date. I've finished doing all the updates now. It's done all ten. Every one of them's now ticked. Every one of them's now installed into the Autel. So it's not a hard process to do. So that's updates over and done with. And that's how you update your Autel DSA two eight.